Everybody, they're ready. Hi. They're ready. Sure Pero Carol. <laughs> Why are you running? Why are you running? Not in my ear. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're in Kanchan Budi. Specifically in the Elephant World Sanctuary where we are going to play with elephants all day today We're going to feed them. We're gonna make some food for them Give them food bathe with them and have a good adventure And I'm super excited because we just arrived to the elephant sanctuary right now We're gonna go change into our clothes and then start the tour and we all did this through our hotel And I'll give you more details on how you guys can do it as well. So let's get started <laughs> Good afternoon. How many two? Whoa, it feels weird. Yeah, He's like, you don't have anything. It's so flexible. Mira como le hace su. Dale, dale, dale uno. Mira, dale uno, Brian. Give him one, give him one. Let's see. That's it, that's it. Hey, girl, make it. Hey, aquí está. Here you go, buddy. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Good. No, yeah, I don't think I'm on. He's smelling. He's smelling. I don't have any more. I don't have any more. <laughs> All right, we're gonna take a group picture. What's this one's name? Maktakta. Hello, Maktakta. Wow. The hairs, the hairs are. They feel like grass. <laughs> this one is Nomuchi. Nomuchi is 40 years old. And she was a lot lucky in the forest and they carried the tourists on the back in the past. And the baby name is Sayo. Sayo. Sayo, he is a boy, he is a leather And when he arrived here, he was two months old. Oh. His mama was carrying the tourists in the back in the past, so that way we can ask you and I will see if they come to apply. This man, this is the, the male elephant. Then we got only two men here. This man and this man. The little one and the big one? The oh, the only two boys. This one, his name is a Chai Chana. Chai Chana, he's a 50 years old. And he was carried the beach with the horse in the past. Oh, wow. And this one is a Nawa. Nawa uh, does not speak to Bore. She keeps her. Uh, yeah, like a little show. You must care about oh. the kid. So oh. she, kept, uh, she was at the show. So that was. So he was going around telling us all the names of the different elephants. To be completely honest, I don't remember, but some of them um, were rescued from a circus. Um, I believe it was one of the uh, bigger females. They were rescued. That one was rescued from a circus. She was a performer there. Um, a lot of the other ones used to do the rides, like the tourist rides that um, are now like you know forbidden or is not really good to do. Um, and then basically they brought them here so they could have this whole sanctuary for them, this whole space for them to just relax. So so then right now what we're going to do is we're going to go down to the river 
and we're gonna go uh, wash ourselves with them. We're gonna bathe with them and things like that. And then we're gonna make um, a food for them. It's like a banana treat that they love. What I noticed is we had a couple different bananas, or sorry, a couple different fruits that we were feeding them and um, they really enjoyed the bananas. We had watermelons, cantaloupes, and things like that, and then they all just enjoyed the banana ones. <laughs> so right now they're, they're calling them to go down to the river because that's where we're gonna meet the elephants and then start um, bathing with them. So this is the exciting part. <laughs> If you want to be a, a elephant caretaker, you have to stay there for one week, one month. Volunteer for one week, one month. It doesn't matter if you want. Yeah, you have to sleep. How cool. So he's basically explaining that if you want to be a volunteer, you can pay 20,000 baht and they basically teach you how to be a caretaker for a week and then you get assigned your own elephant um, and they teach you all of the process of everything for that whole week so that's pretty cool so it includes accommodation food everything so if you're really really interested in just you know spending as much time as you want or as much time as you can with elephants maybe that's a good option that you can look into whoa so this is the river that comes from the waterfalls that we were at the Erewhon national park um waterfalls So another of the uh, volunteers is cutting the banana trees up there um, and then he's bringing it down here so then this one can throw it over here to us. I think we have to carry them back down because this is what we're going to use to feed them. So if you haven't noticed already, if you're going to do this tour, this excursion, definitely bring close toe shoes like these. These are my water friendly shoes so I can get in the water with these and then they'll drain by themselves. I recommend investing in some of these like I said um, in the last video um, at the Erewhon National Park um, because it's it's gonna be annoying kind of bringing just flip-flops here because you're gonna get you know bugs or ants biting you and things like that but there's lots of mosquitoes so bring bug repellent because these mosquitoes are insane. Strong man Antonio! Huh? Oh, Do we all need to carry one? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna start passing it. Oh, okay. It's okay. What are you doing? Oh. Like that? What is that? Huh? Are they mad? No, they're talking to each other. They're talking to each other. Oh. Wow. This is the one I brought him. I want a picture. Yeah, yeah, go, go between. It's okay. <laughs> awesome. Very heavy. One time the elephant teeth fall and compare with the safe side with the, st st the stone, the safe side and but the elephant teeth are more heavy and lot. Mm. Yeah. So, wow. the elephant so he's saying that this one is the biggest one here. It's 2,300 kilograms. That's how much it weighs. That is insane. And right now they're throwing sand on, on themselves because that helps them protect themselves from the heat and the sun. It's kind of like a sunscreen for them. And then they move their ears like that to regulate their body temperature when it's too hot. It's just so cool how they can do so much. Oh, you sure that elephants are afraid of um, mouse, mice? mice? I don't know the mouse, but she doesn't like chicken. She killed three chickens. Oh, there's uh oh, one right there. oh, this one right there is gonna she's kill three chickens. Yeah, she's, yeah. she's the one very nice. You can touch her, you can hug her. She's very sweet. Uh, so she's a grandma. This is grandma? But, no, no, no. Oh. oh, but she hates chicken. She hates chicken. Yeah. <laughs> she killed three chickens. She's already. a vegetarian. She her name is Glenda. She's a 67 <laughs> years old. Whoa, wow. Glenda. And you can, if you want, you can hug her, you can touch her. Yeah. Wow. Oh, <laughs> oh! Nice warm hug with the toilet. I'm not wolfing that. With the trunk. Yeah. With the trunk. It's like. You're gonna make a grass here. Wash your hands first, okay? Before you make it. Yeah. Right here. Oh, we're gonna make it here. Whoa. So what is this? Is it pellet food? Is it this one? Is a 
There's a lot of protein inside. We make it from the grass, special grass. Oh. And banana peel, this one. And also we put a lot of protein inside. It's a, we give only all elephants. It's special for the all elephants. Because it's a special diet for the all elephants. So we give only all elephants. Sorry? How many, How many bar? bar? Yeah. <laughs> Time massage, 200 bar. 200 bar, yeah. 200 bar. <laughs> Time massage, 200 bar. Wanna try? <laughs> no? Okay. <laughs> Oh, she's hungry. Oh, whoa! Come on, dance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah, yeah. So we're gonna do the mud bath right now. The elephants are coming, they are excited. I'm excited for this too. Basically we can take off our shoes and our stuff right here. But since I have my water shoes, I'm just gonna bring them in with me. And then I'm just gonna leave my little pouch. Let's go, hey buddy. They're ready. Hey. They're ready. Pero <laughs> Caroly. I know, he's about to slap you. He's like, what you running away from? Hey, there you go. <laughs> Put some on here. There you go, buddy. Mud. Let me come back here. Bailey. Whoa. Oh, yeah, you can't stand behind. Look, look there. All there. <laughs> that in my ear! <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, wait, 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 wait. Go, go, wait. Wait, 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 <laughs> Gotta go. So wash off. You wash off. No, just put free there. Just go. Who cares? You take your poop water. You did it with your mouth open. You did so Antonio, we were literally get getting splashed no, with play. water that has poop and pee in it. <laughs> wow, look at that one over there. So after we finished splashing around with the elephants and having a great time with them, we went back towards the main area, the pavilion, to dry off and we were greeted with some fresh food. I was so excited for this part because it was an all-you-can-eat buffet. You know, my, my fat behind loves to eat. <laughs> so well, they had their typical rice, uh, veggies, and they had some really good crispy chicken with the all-time favorite chili sauce or the sweet chili sauce which was awesome and you could repeat as many times as you wanted and this was just such a good way to end the day because we had so much fun making food for these elephants and bathing with them taking pictures with them playing with them all these things so it was just such a fun fun tour and i definitely recommend it to all of you guys just make sure when you are choosing a place to um uh, hang out with elephants make sure it is a uh, ethical sanctuary because a lot of the places in thailand are now starting to say oh yeah we're a sanctuary we're a sanctuary when in reality they're not so this place here elephant world was amazing and i definitely recommend it you can find it in the link in the description if you want to book a tour with them so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you loved it i'll see you guys in the next one because the thailand vlogs are gonna keep on coming see you guys